Hey, what's up everybody? Wanted to bring you guys something a little different today. A couple Yu-Gi-Oh boxes, maximum gold, El Dorado. Gonna open these up while I enjoy myself a nice little Voodoo Ranger. Let's check out what's inside. Box one. I've never actually opened any of these up before. Let's see how they look. Pretty cool packaging. Well, that's kind of in there. So they're three packs or four packs. Not too bad. Box number one. Pretty cool packaging. First pack. Honestly, I don't even know what to expect in these. The Phantom Knights of Ancient Cloak. The Weather Cloudy Canvas. I got a... Ooh, that's a gold rare. Fossil Dyna Pachipalo. Gold rare. Pretty cool card. I'm not sure if we get a gold rare in every pack or so on, but I got one. Can't complain about that. Let's leave that up. Next up, Deep Sea Diver. Oh wow, another one. Eld Lakesor of Black Awakening. This one's not a hollow. I'll take it. Got myself a Alter Jice Marrow something. And a Hot Red Dragon Arch Fiend Bane. Yu-Gi-Oh's always had some crazy looking artwork. Okay, first pack, pretty cool. Two gold rare cards. Again, I'm not sure how they're rarities or anything, but I was, I was happy with that. Next up, Hot Red Dragon Arch Fiend Abyss. Trap Trick, Eldritch the Mad Golden Lord, whoa, oh wow, I would imagine that's a good pull, Exodia the Forbidden One, that's the head, I have no idea the worth in these, but that is an awesome pull. Check that out. Another gold rare, Evolzar Dolka. It's seeming like there's probably two gold rares per pack, maybe? One hollow, one not? Or, I'm not sure. That Exodia was awesome, though. I remember back then when I used to play, actually play the TCG. Exodia was awesome. Prank Kids Fancies. Hwak. Waquero of the Golden Land. Cool. Next pack. Black Dragon Collapser Print. Collapser Print. Number four, Numeron Gate Cast something. Gold Rare, Elemental Hero Neos. That's a cool card. Never seen it before. I got a Hit of the Fire Chamber. Oh, wow, these, this one's bent. 
Is this one bent? I don't think that card's bent. This card is bent right here. If you could see it from that glare. I don't know what's up with that. Next card. The Weather Painter Snow. This one's not bent. Just that random one is bent. Good thing it wasn't a gold card that was bent. So it's seeming like two gold rares per packs. Pretty cool. Prank Kids Pender Pandemonium. And the Hot Red Dragon Archfiend Bane. Pulled that one already. Cool card. I'll read their effects later. Last pack. First box. These packs actually open up insanely easy. I haven't opened Yu-Gi-Oh! in a minute. First card, Lost World. Ghost Mourner of Moonlit Chill. It's gold rare. Awesome. Grab a sleeve. Next up, Scrap Dragon, Deep Sea Diva, Ghost Mourner of Moonlit Chill, sleeve that one up, Joaquero of the Golden Land, Prank Kids Fantasy, that's four packs, next box. Let's check it out. Again, cool little box. Opens up. Four packs are there. One. I can't take that one out. Two. That away, four packs. Let's check it out. Shuffle them. Open up. Second box start up. Let's check it out. White Dragon Wyver Buster. Gold Rare Mystic Mine. That one, I feel like it has a little. Something going on right here. Maybe not. Let's leave it up. Prank Kids Rocket Ride. Scrap Golem. Danger Bigfoot. Oh, that's a cool looking card. 3000 attack. Kind of a beast, huh? Let's leave that up. Giant Rex. Shooting Code Talker. Next pack. Second pack. Let's see if I can pull another nostalgic card. That'd be awesome. That Exodia's head was cool. Black Dragon Collapse Serpent. Look at that. You see that line? What's going on there? Some type of production problem with these. Hopefully I get nothing bad with the gold rares. Number CI. Number on Chaos Gate. Sonia. Cybers Gadget. S Super Dreadnought Rail Cannon Juggernaut. Vibe, look, this one has a, a slash going across it, too. Printing problems. The weather painter snow. The good thing is the gold rares haven't been beat up. Oh, back to back gold rares on that one. Sky Striker Ace Ray. Let's leave that one up. 
I like those gold borders. Number one, Numeron Gate Ecam. Okay. Two packs left. Yeah, really thin packs. Rip up pretty easily. Golden Land Forever. Trishula Dragon of the Ice Barrier. That's a cool looking card. Just leave it up. Next card, Fossil Dig. Oh, I remember that one. Broken Line. Conquestador of the Golden Land. That one up. Sleeving up the gold rares. Joaquero the Golden Land. Prank Kids Fancies. It's pretty cool that they're all rare cards though. With the gold letters on top. Last pack. Can I get a last pack magic? Seems like I'll for sure pull two gold rares. The question is which ones? Hopefully another nostalgia card would be great. X Code Talker. Elixir the White Destiny. Fossil Dig. There's a line across that one too. Numeron Storm. Gold rare. Get a sleeve out real quick. I got stuck. Ooh, I, I like this one. We got a classic Book of Moon Gold Rare. Again, not sure about worth or rarity, but that's a nostalgic card to me. And then we got Signet Mining and Altergeist Marionetter. All right, those two boxes, eight packs. Each pack carries two gold rares. I was able to pull this Book of Moon, Numeron Storm, Conquestador of the Golden Land, Trishula Dragon of the Ice Barrier, Sky Striker, the Weather Painter Snow, Danger, Bigfoot, Mystic Mine, Ghost Mourner of the Moonlight Chill, Ghost Mourner of the Moonlight Chill, whoa, what's going on there, same card, different names, I'll read it later, <laughs> the Weather Painter Show, Snow, I'm sorry, Elemental Hero Neos. Evil Zardolka. I, I would imagine this is a cool card right here. Exodia, the Forbidden One. Check that out. Check out the centering. The centering looks good to me. That was an awesome pull right there. Elixir of the Black Awakening and uh, Fossil Dina something. That's it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this quick video. I hope you have a blessed day. And uh, you guys take it easy.